Hello everybody, this is Money Mom. Welcome back to the channel. I'm doing another video which I'll be posting Sunday on frugal ways that my 19 year old daughter stays slender. My, you have not met my beautiful daughter. She was a dancer in high school. She's now in college and she's actually kept her weight down. She may even weigh a little bit less. She doesn't like me to share her weight but I will say that she wears between a 2 and a 4 and she works at keeping her weight down and I wanted to tell you the 10 quick tips on how she does this because they're very frugal. Number one, she only drinks water. She doesn't drink sodas or anything else. She drinks a lot of water. That's number one. Number two, a lot of friends her age go out to eat a lot. She very rarely ever goes out to eat. She mostly eats at home so she kind of knows what she's eating. Number three, she starts her day with protein. Like this morning she asked all of us, would any of you like eggs? This way it gives her a good start for the day and it, you know, it fills her up for a longer period of time. Number four, this is the biggest thing that helps. She's very much into, and she doesn't use this terminology, but uh, Freedom on a Budget talks about this, intuitive eating. She really listens to her body. Even if everybody else is eating something, if she doesn't want to eat it, she doesn't. If she's not hungry, she doesn't eat. So she really listens to her body. For example, one of my dear friends brought us over some quiches. She heated herself up one. She ate half of a quiche and she, t and she didn't want any more. She took the other quiche and put it in a Ziploc bag for another time. Now, I don't know about you, but for me, I always feel like I have to finish my food. My daughter never f has the clean plate mentality. Uh, number five, this sounds silly, but she, wear she buys form-fitting clothes that she likes that looks good on her. She buys all of her jeans from Old Navy because they're best for her body type. She uh, has a smaller waist so those are the jeans that are good for her and she buys them form fitting and so they're you know they fit really well but it wouldn't allow for a big weight gain like if you were to wear sweats for example. Okay also number six if she ever does feel kind of bloated or maybe feels kind of like after holiday blues she, uh, you know, notices it. She'll maybe drink more water and she'll definitely cut back on her eating for the next several days uh, to make sure that she doesn't let it get out of hand. So, number seven, she weighs herself regularly. Not every day, but at least maybe once, twice a week or once every other week or something just to make sure she's in check with, you know, and making sure that her clothes are fitting properly and all of that. Number eight, she doesn't she wastes food which I know you're thinking what so in other words she leaves food on her plate and I've never since she's been a little girl I never make her feel like she has to finish any of her food there's times that we do end up throwing things away because I don't want her to feel like she has to eat something just to finish her food so she does waste food sometimes in order to not gain weight uh, this is the big other one she wanted me to say she does exercise at what she loves to do. Even if everybody else was going to go do a certain exercise, say spin class, and if it wasn't an interest, she loves to dance. That's her favorite thing. She knows all different kinds of dance. And there's times where my husband and I will go out and do something. We'll come home and her face is beat red and she's out of breath because she's been at home here doing all of her dance exercises. So she does exercise at something that she really enjoys. And last but not least, number 10. If it's meal time and she's not hungry or she had a later breakfast and, and it's meal time and she doesn't want to eat, she doesn't eat. There's been a lot of times at dinner she doesn't eat her food. So basically to sum it up, she pays attention to when her body wants something. And she pays attention to what her clothes feel like to make sure that she's in check with what she's doing. She's not asking for any special food and all of this can be done very frugally. Now, if I could eat like a 19 year old and stay that size, that would be wonderful. I hope that some of these tips have encouraged some of you. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you for Money Making Monday. Love you. Bye.